First tonight, there are still a lot of questions regarding the upcoming school year. Good evening, I'm Mike Montecalvo. And I'm Shannon Heggie. Today, the Rhode Island Department of Education announced the school year will be pushed back. The first day of school is now officially September 14th, but the type of schooling students will receive is still up in the air. Eyewitness News reporter Sheena Lasciuto has been on top of the story all day and joins us now with the latest. Sheena? So at this point, there's still no word on what the first day of school looks like. If kids are going back in person, if there's a hybrid model, or if kids are staying at home with a distance learning model. That decision was supposed to be made sometime next week, but now that the beginning of the school year is being delayed, a decision on that is being pushed back too. Education Commissioner Angelica Fonte Green confirms the first day of school for Rhode Island students will now be September 14th. That's two weeks after the initial start date of August 31st. Eyewitness News was forwarded a copy of the letter superintendents received Tuesday. In it, the Education Commissioner offers these explanations. We are adjusting the first day of classes for students to Monday, September 14th. This will give you, your teams, and all your school communities more time to prepare for a successful start of the year. The letter also states the decision on how students will go back will be made during the week of August 31st. As we've previously reported, the call will be made by the Department of Health, which again means parents won't know what the first day of school looks like until about two weeks before. The letter also states these changes have created five additional planning days between August 31st and September 8th for your teams to use in ensuring you are ready for whichever scenario we use on the first day of school. From full in-person to full distance learning as well as to continue to work with and gather input from your school communities. And since the school year is starting later, the end of the school year will be later too. According to a calendar sent to superintendents, the last day of class will now be June 25th. I'm Sheena Lushudo, Eyewitness News.